What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Seth, and we are back again for another Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Hello, strange man. <laughs> right now, we're supposed to be following the Baron. Excuse me if I'm sitting a little bit awkwardly. I got a cat sitting on my lap right this moment as I'm trying to record. Go away, kitty. What is this? Where? When she was a babe, my daughter loved animals. Okay, cool. Saw a deer trophy on a wall once. Do you know what she asked? No. I haven't got a clue. Papa, is that deer's wump on the other side of the I wall? Need a good <laughs> <laughs> you see it there? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh, whoops. We're going to go well, and investigate about his daughter, the that's right. Who's hurt her? I'll flay him alive. Look at this it? psycho! Damn it. Jammed again. Our bedchamber. Tamara's room is there. All right. This guy's really Try weird. Whoa! Place. We're teleporting through the door turn, and stuff? Let us use our psychic place. ability. Shut up out there! I'm trying to do stuff. I'm trying to eat lunch here. So we're trying to investigate about his daughter, which gives us clues to Siri. Wooden candlestick. Stem's broken. Uh, yes. The butler did it. Somehow. I don't know how, but he just did. Whoa. I thought I thought that was some kind of epic music in the game, but it turns out it was just a car driving by in real life. Hello, thing. He expects them to return any minute. Takes hope. I okay. I don't quite understand what he's talking about. What was that? I saw some weird thing. Oh, it's just extinguishing stuff. You know what? In 2 seconds here, I mean, I have to change my settings because it seems to have changed them on me. I don't know why. A different color. Something used to hang here. A hmm. painting. That painting? Right size. That painting? <laughs> Wait, oh, that one. Okay, so that means there's a secret behind it. <gasps> What's he going to tell the us? The Baron and his wife. <laughs> Look happy enough. Yes. What's behind it? Too bad I didn't actually show him move it. What's this? Huh. Gotta wonder who wanted to hide the hole. And what's on the other side. Excuse me? <laughs> what? Use your witcher senses to search the room. Oh! I see, so it's hiding something inside this thing that I guess is otherwise locked? Nope, it's just right hmm. there. It gets interesting. Piece of wood looks like the stem of that candlestick. No coincidence there. Okay. Hmm. Fight might have happened here. I don't look for clues. Weren't we already looking for clues? Or does he mean more stuff like these scratch marks over here? Yes. Deep nicks. Hit with a heavy object. A werewolf's claw. Where, where, oh where, Treyhawk, where, oh where is thine werewolf? Huh. Rest of the candlestick. And wine stains. Somebody smashed a bottle. Or maybe Don't they were just sound. having fun. Yeah. Erveloose. Scent hasn't died. Wonder where it'll lead me. What? Evoluce? What's an Evoluce? Oh! <gasps> now it's leading us back outside, yes please, into the other room. The plot thickens. Down, down, down. Wait, was it pointing into here or did it point to- Nope. <laughs> it pointed us downstairs. I just thought that it stopped right there. Ooh. Damn, trail breaks off. Talisman. Mm, could Spruce find something wood. else though. Smells of juniper incense. Some sort of folk talisman. Don't detective. talk over yourself. Question is, against what? Won't find much else here. Okay, so we could have actually gone into this other room and gotten some clues, uh, but I guess overall it was just leading to the talisman Spence anyway. Don't poking around. Yep. I know what you think about this. Recognize this amulet? Do you? Hmm. Yes. Anna began wearing it a time ago. Any idea where she got it? None. Any witches or cunning women in the area? Yeah, Pella. Old Coot lives near Blackbow. And there's a cunning woman in Midcops, but I know little about her. She's only recently <laughs> arrived. If Anna were to see someone, she'd choose the Pella. Okay. Anna was wary of strangers, newcomers. I don't know who that is or what. I'm off to see the Pella, the wonderful oh, Pella of us. Pella. Fair warning, he's a hard man to talk to. Okay. Rumor has it, he killed his own father with a as a lad, then went batty. Now they say he sees ghosts and plows his goat. 
Not really interested in his hobbies. <laughs> Just want to ask about the amulet. Yeah! You you tell him, Mr. Mr. Witchman. Y yeah! Somehow, Bowser, we got level 7 from that. Awesome! So you know what? Actually, while we're while we're here, while we got a little bit of a break interval, I'm gonna change my controls and see what we can invest in with our X points. There we go. Took care of all the controls and stuff. Didn't actually touch our character. So let's just take a quick little peek here, because one of the big things that I like developing the most is our fire ability. This beautiful fire ability right here, the one that we barely ever use. I'm going to upgrade that again. Actually, you know what? No. What we're going to upgrade now is finally get our main, like, fast attack damage up a little bit. Because that's that's one of the biggest things that we run into is our attacks just don't seem to be strong enough. There's also, oh, there's this cash over there or a stash, like in Diablo. Uh, but we're not going to, we're probably not going to use any of those. Ooh, where are we now? Because when we entered this area, it kind of automatically just threw us into this, into this battle, like, it, well... In, into the keep uh, let's actually let's go to our meditation let's make it daytime please although that nighttime was actually quite beautiful definitely gotta use the daytime because otherwise it's just way too dark excuse me fine beautiful people but you have to get out of the way or I'll kill you what's all this then there we go improve our other thing and our other thing and is this a smithy over here is that what that icon means? Okay, yeah, it's legit a smitty. How may I assist you? Depends. I hope you're a higher enough level that he can offer us some stuff. Looking for a master armor. <gasps> Looking for someone who can craft me some armor. Gotta be top quality. Yes. Well, I've been out of 20 years now. Master the craft in some respects, if I do say so myself. <laughs> All right. You wish. What? Don't listen to her. <laughs> She's been sore lately. Snorting every chance she gets. So, what kind of armor are we talking about? Light, but durable. Can't constrain movement, and I gotta be able to get in it without anybody's help. That all? Sure it shouldn't be self-cleaning? Yep. A and how about it wipe your arse after you take a shite in the bushes? Excuse me? Could it? Strong and light will do just fine. <laughs> Comfortable, strong and light will do just fine. Ought to know one thing when it comes to armor. If it's got to be durable, it can't be light. Yep, I know it that. Can. Just needs the proper tools I... to make it. Tools like the folk of Clan Tordoroch used on Undvik. You what? Anna, I told you time and again to stay silent when I talk to customers. Shouldn't pester folk with those nonsense Skellige legends of yours. It ain't legend, and it ain't nonsense. Well, um... My granddad would go to Undvik for his armor. Said Tordoroch folk made the best. Till last year, that is, when a giant ravaged their island. All right. The inhabitants either ran off or died, <clears throat> but the forge should still be in one piece. Worth looking into. Yeah. Say I find the tools. Will you craft the armor for me? <clears throat> On condition you bring the tools. But only then. Oh. So she was saying that there is an island out there. Man, this is why I love this game. The lore is amazing. So there's an island that was taken over by giants, and we're going to go get f tools for this guy to forge us some stuff. Know where the forge is? Yes, please. These legends mention where the forge might we'll be. We'll never be able to take that on. North side of the isle, in a cave. Clan folk carved out a rock face to build it. Okay. Never mind. I thought you were talking about some kind of giant island, but whatever. Look for the tools next time I'm in Skellige. Take care now. Yep, I will. Excuse me, don't shove me, bro. I don't know. You, for some reason, walked away. <laughs> Wouldn't mind a look at your stop. Yes, please, there we go. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so this is garbage. We can sell that. Uh, we can hang on to all that other beautiful stuff. What is this, garbage? Ah, we don't need to buy those repair kits. That's okay. This guy seems he has a lot of recipes, though. Trackers, gauntlets, and junk like that. No thanky you. That's a quest item. That's just a bunch of our junk we could probably destroy. <laughs> uh, let's take a peek, though. I want to see, first of all, how much is it going to cost to repair? Let's repair all while we can. Yes, please. And then let's also check. How do you, how do you reorganize all this? Filters. There it is. Can be produced. All parts present. 
cannot be produced. Let's get rid of those and the wrong craftsmanship level. So what this guy can actually make for us, what is this? Is this, oh, it's medium armor. Medium, listen to my voice breaking. Required level 16, I don't think so. We'll have much better armor by the time we get to that kind of level. This is all, it's all kind of crappy, isn't it? All right, whatever, you know what? That's okay, let's get out of here. Leave me alone. No, I don't want to play Gwant. Gwant. <laughs> or whatever their weird card game is. I don't care. Uh, let's double check here, by the way. I wanted to see. You have blade oil in your inventory. Use it on your blade. All right, I will. Use left and right to select the... What? I want to put on this new sword. There we go. Beautifulness. They're trying to get us over here. Where's our blade oil? What are they talking about? Select the oil and press A to use it. Then choose to confirm which sword you want to apply it to. I think it's talking about this. Which, it seems like we can only apply it to the one blade, unfortunately. What? But we will do that. Now your sword will deal more damage to opponents that are vulnerable to this oil. Oh! Attacks versus power. Oh my goodness! So the oil doesn't waste in this game as well, does it? That is absolutely amazing! Now we finally got our hands on our sword, though. I've been waiting for that, because as much as I like... Blah, 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 as much as I like the axe... I still, I still very much have always very, like, swords are awesome. <laughs> I'll just say that much. Let's actually take a gander at our map here. See what we got around us. We got quite a few side quests that we could do. Whoa! There's a lot of side quests over there. And the main quest is in that direction too, so you know what? We will head in that direction. Let's, let's go down there and see what we can see. Not, not necessarily going for the main quest right away because we're probably going to do a couple side quests today just because i don't know it, it's just kind of like whatever you feel like you know that's that's the real point hello other weird merchant that i kind of want to set on fire but we can't because then we'd be a criminal <laughs> and we would get in trouble with the law and stuff my goodness this game is beautiful I keep forgetting how gorgeous it is because I don't get to play this game that often. Like a lot of times, uh, you may have noticed. Blow your whistle, Jabrias! Where are you? I'm right here, Master. I was here the whole time. Um, sometimes I will actually record like a couple episodes of Witcher in a row just because I kind of have to. And because of that, like, because I don't get that often to spend on this game as much as I would like to. Especially with the fact, I mean, this game is so cool. Monster's Nest. Whoa! They're all level 9 monsters. Okay. Well, that kind of worked. Let's do Let's this. Go. Come on, Jabrias. We have you. Yeah. All right. Don't swing your sword. Just take five years to do it. That always works. Ah, yeah! Go, Jabrias. No, don't get too afraid. I'm scared, master. No. I don't... Uh. Pull out your sword, please. Stop putting it away. You know what? He's being too weird. Whoa, is he ever. So forget it. Let us do this ourselves. Give me fire. Yes! Take this, you weird monster. Oh, that's you. No, 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 no. I want to. I want, I want. Out! That's you! Wee! Exploding barrels, do it! Yes! Bowser! They didn't expect that one, did they? That was amazing. Where Green is this? Nest. Where? Just destroy it. Where? Oh, there it is, secretly. So this is probably going to be a place where a bunch of people are going to come up and be like, Hey, thank you, man. Whoa! The camera's being a little bit weirder. Was that it, really? <laughs> okay, it wasn't guarded at all. Achoo! Let's set those ablaze just because why not? So we can get that. That to happen. Explosion behind him. Get off the tree. Get, get on Jabias. Let, let's go over here. Uh, let's actually see. Is there another quest that's nearby? Oh, it actually shows 67 side quests. That's how much we could do if we wanted to right now. My goodness gracious. Whoa there, Roach. I don't know if we're ever going to end up like... I, it is not my goal to try and max this game out. Because otherwise we will be on this game for like a million years. Like seriously, we would, uh, especially with it only being once a week, we would end up being on this game 
till like next year, like seriously. It really reminds me of when I ended up doing my gothic series, which that was another one. I don't think it took that long, but it did take a very long time. No, I don't think we're going to fight those wolves, but we are going to fight these aliens. Yeah! Oh, never mind. Ah! Take this, you stupid monsters! Pull out the correct sword. Aliens from Mars! Oh my goodness, look at them. They they just got here from the other planet, and they don't want no we come in peace. Yeah, right! Nothing this ugly would come in peace. Yeah! <laughs> and that's why we're killing them all, right? You can go ahead and swing at me. I, I don't even care. Dogs! And you! Uh, well, at least we got most of them. Take that, weirdos. Uh-oh. Yeah! What's happening? Stop glitching out and putting your sword away, you fool! Yeah! I didn't even do our at you. Oh, whatever. Look at him. Just look at him. Such a disgusting enemy. Seriously, like, who sat there? I, I would love to see concept art of that enemy. It's probably even more gross and realistic. <laughs> like, look at these guys. Ugh. Ew. <laughs> oh, man, these guys are so weird. Oh, give me your weird monster claw. I don't even care. Oh, this was guarded loot. No wonder there was so many of them. All right, what did we even get? Some kind of weird potion thing. All right, cool. We, we got a free potion. Bloop. Let's set that one up so we just keep following the coastline. What are all these birds up ahead? What are they symbolizing? Oh, hangman. Stick hangman. But, you know, real, oh! Hello? Can I help you? You weird pitchfork freak? Who are you? What do you, what do you think of me? What is this? What did this man do to you? What? Him? Nothing. Appeared in the village. Looking to trade his ring for some bread. But we've no food. None. Because of the black ones. Trampled our fields. Raided our granaries. Burnt our orchards. So instead of bread, he'll get a noose. Why? Please. Good folk, do you not have ears? I did not want this war. I have deserted to go home to my wife and child. Take everything I have, but spare my life. Why is he looking at us? I guess because he knows we're the only ones that can do something about it. Release him! You guys are ugly and therefore you're bad. Let him go. He's all right looking. I'm sure. And maybe give him some fixings for the journey. Saddle up a horse for him. Excuse Black me. Black one showed us no mercy. We show them none in return. Just as I will show you none. Try it asking nicely. Tried it the nice way. Gotta try something different. All right, that works as well. Why is it? What? Who are all these other people? You, you magic spell? Oh no! Didn't expect that one, did ya? Ha! Yes, I am the Witcher. Oh my goodness! Hum num num num. Let's use this weird potion of buffness. Yes! Yeah! Ra! You are going to die. Oh, he's already dead. Bro, magic spell. Oh, we didn't count on him using magic. <laughs> now, was that really worth it? Kill four men Thank to you. save one? If you had not come. Yes. If I had not come, only one man would have died. Really going back to your wife? Yes. She bore a child just before the war started. A girl. I named her Beatrice after her grandmother. Okay, that's a pretty Why? bad name. Why did you help me? Your mustache. It, it's, I hate lynch mobs. It was the lesser evil. Okay, never mind this deep response. I hate the mobs. Lynch mobs. Nothing good ever comes of them. Now go. He's disappointed. Stay off the high roads and give any villages a wide berth until you cross the Aruga. Dude, I like saved your life. The least you could do is say thank you. But instead, no. No, we will not accept thanks because we don't do it for the thank yous. Get out of the way, you weird skeleton. See, it is just like Hangman. All right. It, it is just like Hangman, where there's a stick figure that is being hung. 
All right, so what is this crap over here? There's a sign that we can't talk to. Hidden treasure. <gasps> Why does it say that it's hidden? Oh, because it's in some weird skeletal man. Hello. What are you? Water damage letter. Where? Track the quest. Re track the quest. Oh, it just says read the letter we found. Never mind. All right, so is there any better weapons and stuff in here? I very much doubt it. Ooh. This armor is very, very close. Gives more vitality. It also gives a lot more resistance, that's for sure. We don't get our piercing damage, though. Uh, it could be because its durability is low. I wonder if that's why it's not as good. So we'll hang on to that for now. Because otherwise it is a higher level, right? You've already read this book. So handy. Love it. Find the sunken treasure using your Witcher senses. Okay. Is that it? Is that what it's trying to tell us? Or did it mark it somewhere else? Let's see whether or not it's still around. Oh, it is still around here. So it is under the water. Okay. Oh. Okay. Weird underwater creatures. We're not going to be able to fight them. I don't think the game understands that we can't uh, fight enemies in the water. So that's going to be a little bit tricky. Dive, you fool. Oh, my goodness. I see a gigantic shell. It's beautiful. My goodness, I'm getting screenshots. Grab the loot! Gildorf's sword is ours! I don't know who Gildorf is, or what his name, what he, what he's got to do with a sunken, hidden treasure, but... Bleh, come with me right into my trap monsters. Oh, they gave up immediately. <laughs> I guess land is as scary to them as water is scary to me. Let us find out. Was that a good sword? <gasps> nope, it's absolutely garbage. <laughs> it would have been good earlier on. If we didn't end up buying this sword, it probably would have been pretty good. But that's cool. I love how all the side quests, like almost every single one of them, despite there being so many of them, are very, very fleshed out. Like they, these guys really did a fantastic job with this game. Just stretching out the content all over the place. I see some weird ship up ahead too. Everything seems to be battle. Which is okay, because battle is not- Oh, these guys- These are men! Battle is not a bad thing. Because it's, like, so fun in this game, too. Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! Oh, my arm! Oh, who is this guy? What is he doing? He's coming back again! No! Slow-mo attack! I want to do that again. <laughs> We're such a jerk in this game. Who do you think you are? You think you can handle the witcher? <laughs> we cut him in half. We cut him in half. No, Teddy. Hey, you cut my friend. Please spare me. Spare me. <laughs> oh, it was a little side quest. What is he doing? Why is he getting off? Cutscene trigger. Go. Why? Oh. Thank you, oh, thank you, thank you. They're giving us golf clap too. No problem, guys. I've saved you from the pirates, man. <laughs> Can we set this house on fire? That would be nice. My goodness, what a beautiful shot. He looks amazing. His character model is just, it's gorgeous, man. Seriously, whenever it zooms in, it's always like, astounds me how good this game looks. Well, you know what? Fine. If you're gonna do something like that, let's just meditate. Wait. Nah. Until it is daytime. So he doesn't sleep. He waits. <laughs> Seriously. That is just crazy. It's crazy talk. Where is our treasure, by the way? Loot. A bunch of plates and stuff, so that's gonna be good. Steel plates, not just... Ooh. Some special leather. Is that going to lead to another quest? I wonder. Okay, this is all a bunch of garbage, except for that other thing might have been good secretly. I don't honestly know. Uh, where was it? Oh, it was in the new books category. That's right. Uh, so it's been a little while, but they already ended up putting out, like, th there's been quite a few different patches that has added quite a bit of content to this game, honestly. And this is one of them, which is actually amazing, where it actually shows you which books you have and haven't read. Which is great, especially for questing and stuff. What is this? Some kind of tournament? I don't care. 
We're getting a bunch of bestiary, and I don't know if we're getting quests from these books necessarily. Did we? No, it doesn't look like it. Did we? I don't know. I, I honestly don't know. I don't think so because I don't think those are quest books. Well, let's just keep following the path. Following the side road, whatever you want to call it. And we'll probably... Oh, there's an island over there. I want to check that out. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm taking screenshots. That looks amazing, man. But yeah, next episode, we'll probably end up going a little bit more for the main quest. But as for today, I really wanted to do this. A slow motion attack. <laughs> no, we're just aliens from outer space. We're not evil. Yes, you are. I, as the Witcher, will decide what is evil and what is not. Come here, you weird freak. Stand straight. <laughs> Off with his head. <laughs> And just cut that one in half just for good measure. Whoop! Get off the horse, please. I really hope there is not some gigantic sea monsters later in the game when we start sailing the seven seas. That would be horrible. Smuggler's note! Track quest! Yes, please. Where is this smuggler's note? Yoink! Oh, there's another book that we can read for a quest, too. Okay. I didn't know that for the longest time. Costly mistake. Why is it... Is it trying to tell us... Yeah, I think it is legit trying to tell us that this area is going to be too dangerous. But you know what? Since we're very close to calling the episode today anyways, uh, we can find the second treasure using, oh, Witcher senses. So we are going to try and go over here. I really hope we can survive. I really hope there's no kind of giant sea monster because then I'll just... Then I give up. There's something swimming after us. Is that just one of the aliens? Yeah, I think it is. There's actually a lot of them. Wow, is there ever? Can we even get to that treasure with all those guys swimming around? I honestly don't know. This is going to be tough, man. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. This is not going to be good. This is not going to go well. So where is that hidden treasure? You know it's underwater. That is a lot of seagulls. This totally symbolizes... Like, it reminds me of... Um, there's some treasure over there. At least. It reminds me of Wind Waker. When they had, oh goodness, go, 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 go. When, whenever there was a bunch of seagulls and it would be like a gigantic boss fight. Okay, that wasn't anything. <gasps> Dive underwater. Uh-oh. No, don't attack me. Don't touch me. Why is he not swimming faster? Oh, because, oh. Okay, that's a level 10 drowner. That's not good. Where is this special treasure, man? Swim faster! I don't know if it's trying to tell us that this treasure... Ooh! No you don't, you weird monster! It's a good thing they're just as bad at swimming as we are. Where is this secret treasure? What is he doing? Swim! Swim! Stop getting attacked, man! There's actually... Oh, it's a giant weird monster! Okay, we gotta get out of here. That looks like all of our treasure right there, though. That definitely looks like our treasure. So let's get up here. And I wish we could lure these guys. I wish they would actually get up here so we could fight them. Because unfortunately, we don't seem to be able to fight them underwater. And that is very bad, man. That's not good. Ah! Whoa, that super one is coming at us with his friends. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. Ah Got the loot. Get out of here. Swim faster, please. Swim a lot faster than that, please, brah. Do it! Alright, get to the surface, then swim. He seems to be a lot faster. Let us get out of here. That is such a deadly spot. And for all the wrong reasons, too, because we can't fight back. What is... Whoa! <laughs> okay, never mind. That scared me. I thought that was some kind of giant monster bird. Turns out it's just a ghost. <laughs> no! I wanted to grab the treasure! No! Run! No! Okay, so we can't fight that either. <laughs> This place is so deadly, man. All right, so at least now we know there is a bunch of side quests that we are definitely going to have to revisit. Who is that enemy? Are you following me to the surface here? You following us? You following me? No, it isn't. Well, you know what? That's still good enough. That is still pretty darn cool. Let us double check what we ended up getting. Whoa! 
That's one heck of a sword just because of the amount of openings that it has, but I still think our sword might be better. I could be wrong about that, but I think armor piercing is a pretty good stat. But bonus X points from monsters is also very good, so... And the three empty slots, that might actually top ours. I'm not exactly sure, we will have to see. Um, anything else we got? What is this? Nope, no thank you. Don't need that. Don't need that. And without further ado, we are going to call it for today's episode, ladies and gentlemen. So I know we kind of just wandered around, but hey, we ended up getting some pretty good gear out of it. I just got to go and repair it. Next episode, we're probably going to end up spending a little bit more time focusing on the main quest because the main quest gives us a ton of levels and makes us stronger for all these side quests, you know? But every now and then, I do like to play... Uh, just play around and stuff just to kind of have fun and enjoy the game for what it is, you know But anyway, thanks so much for watching. I really do appreciate it I would also appreciate if you would smack that like button share favorite and subscribe to join T-Pixel Sino and stay epic everybody Believe in yourself